time for Imagine It. We are on location in the Imagination Station, and today we are playing some mind games. We have Carl Nelson yes. here, and Carl, I'm already dizzy. What are we doing? We're in Mind Zone. This entire 5,000 square feet exhibit focuses on how your brain works, how perception works. Okay. One of my favorite experiences is called the Trizonal Space Warper. I didn't even know this had a name. It does, and okay. it's, it's actually fairly famous. Um, the effect was first noticed by the ancient Greeks when staring at a waterfall. You see water falling down, mm -hmm. you stare at it for a while, and you look to the right, the trees look like they're moving upward. Ah. It's called an after effect motion. Okay. And this particular trizonal space warper is named that way because there's three counter rotating regions of spirals. Hmm. And it magnifies the effect a little bit. Jerry Andres, a magician back in the 70s, actually came up with this as part of his, his skit, oh, his, very his neat. program. Um, and so what you do is you actually stare at the center of this. And what happens is the uh, neurons in your brain become fatigued. They're all little chemical engines, okay? okay. And so if you stare at something that's moving in this way, those chemical engines get depleted of the chemicals they have to sense that direction. Ah. Okay, and then some strange things start to happen. And it's best if we just actually do it. Okay. okay? So if we can have you and the visitors at home stare at this spiral, and you're going to stare at it All for right. like 20 seconds. Okay. Okay, and you don't want to look away. You want to make sure you're looking just at the center spot. The harder and longer you stare, and don't try not to even blink, it'll magnify the effect. And what we're doing is we're depleting um, some of those it's cells. It's getting larger and larger and larger. It, it's it's going to so get. It it's going to look really weird as you're staring at it. But the best part is, I'll, I'll give you a countdown. What I want you and the visitors at home to do is look at the back of your hand. Okay. Once you do that, or in your case, Christina, you could look over here at me, and I want you to describe what's happening. Okay. So in three, two, one. Look at my face. Oh, wow. You almost look like you're coming towards me and then distorting back. You look small. And, and the brain hat helps yeah, as well. Yeah, the brain hat <laughs> threw me <laughs> off a little bit. No, it wears off pretty quickly. I feel like I'm starting to come back to normal pretty fast. Well, and the interesting thing here is that some people claim that this happens in your retina, and ah, others claim okay. it happens in your brain. And there's no... Well, there, there is an answer, but I'm not going to give it away. But there's mm. a test you could do. Okay. Right? We have this on our website. You can go to the website and look at this animated GIF as well. Oh, okay. If you stare at it with one eye covered ah. and then swap the covering, uh -huh. see if the effect transfers from one eye to the other. Ooh. That might lead to it being present in the uh, visual system. Okay. If it doesn't transfer, mm -hmm. maybe it's happening in your brain. All right, and did I see the right thing? Was that what? It looked like things yeah, were moving kind of like and crawling. Yeah, like that 3D effect almost, yes. and you're yes. coming towards me. Absolutely, that is what you're looking for. And it is, it's so simple, it's a, a rotating spiral, but there's lots of really nice perception and chemistry inside your head that's going on Very to create cool. those little All right, well, illusions. if you didn't catch it just then, you can rewatch the segment. You can go to the Imagination Station's website and pull up the gift there, or just come down to the Imagination Station. Come into Mind Zone. You can send the kids into the kooky house, and you can stand here and really give your brain or your eyes a, little a real workout. workout. Yeah, absolutely. Awesome. Carl Nelson, thanks so much for shaking it up this morning. I'm seeing double still a little bit here. <laughs> and just a reminder, it is Saturday, so you can come down to the Imagination Station. Children 12 and under get in free with a paid adult for those that live in Lucas County. I'll just give you a minute to adjust your eyes. If you